the Emperor! Hey guys, welcome to another Heavy Metal Diecast video, and today's bad boy we have here is uh, another Warhammer 40,000 uh, figurine, so it's another Warhammer edition. Uh, this is obviously, once again, by Joy Toy. Um, it is in 1A in scale, and this is the Blood Angels veteran Alberigo, or Alberigo. It is in the normal uh, type of box that it does come in. It has the, you know, details of uh, what's within the packet inside there. Um, but, uh, you know, we'll get this plastic off and get this out of the box. And here we have it out of the packet. Um, it does have like a, a little uh, cape that has to be uh, put onto the figurine. Uh, it is made out of the soft sort of uh, a vinyl, PVC vinyl. And that's the, um, as you can see, we'll take that cover off. And as you can see, it does come with all the uh, hand accessories, uh, bolt pistol, the backpack, um, sword, and the figurine itself. It's pretty much uh, all assembled. It's got some really good detail. And uh, what we'll do is we'll grab that figurine out itself. Plonk him there. We'll just move the accessories out of the way. And we'll just have a look at the base figure as you get it by itself. Um, you can see the really nice details on the shoulder pad there. Blood Angels details there. That that, that helmet has got a lot of, lot of nice detail in there as well. It's pretty full on. Uh, we'll have a look at that sh other shoulder pad, the left hand side, and it's got some really nice detail on there. Um, the back, it's got a little um, sort of pouch on the back, it's got a little soft PVC vinyl sort of cape on the, on the back there. Um, the figure does manipulate as per usual, like all the other ones that we uh, have been reviewing. It is a pretty pretty standard sort of uh, setup. It's got a little already, he's got his bolt pistol on there, um, it's got, you know, he's got his seals and it's got all the little accessories on there, some, some great detail on, on the leg armour there. And you can see the, the accessories that do come with it. It's got some really nice detail. And that helmet is really, really, really different. <laughs> it's, um, it's sort of like almost sort of Az, Aztec stylization, But um, I think overall this is um, another, another fine addition. And um, what we'll do is we will um, assemble this bad boy and have a proper good look at it. So here we have it all assembled. The, um, that soft vinyl cape goes on nice. It goes under the, underneath the uh, backpack there. These do turn turn around like they all do on, on all these figures. They do have a bit of a... They are a bit stiff. They do have a bit of a, a manipulation through them. You can adjust those vents. And um, I think overall it's got the um, nice details on the sword. It's got the Blood Angels hanging off the on the back there it's got some really really cool detail um bolt pistol is nice they fit into the hands reasonably nice um there is no massive drama with trying to assemble them at all it's um you just take your time and, and chuck it all together and i think um you know and then 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 you're happy <laughs> so on the front here that's that soft vinyl um pvc sort of type plastic as well and um I think uh, overall it's a it's a pretty pretty good uh, addition. It's a very very nice looking veteran. Um, but uh, yeah, what what I'll do is I'll, I'll keep it short and sweet with these. Um, the manipulation in these it's the same as per usual. The arms all move, the the legs move, they all twist and turn. Um, there is a lot of manipulation and positioning uh, that you can do with these. And um, I think uh, overall, you know, once again, it's a, another top top figure. Uh, I paid I think around. Seventy dollars for this, or sixty? I think it was sixty dollars for this, um, and that was including the postage to me as well. And um, I think that wasn't too bad a price, to be honest. And um, I think it's a uh, yeah, pretty pretty good looking unit, and uh, for what it is. Uh, but yeah, you know, something different with the with the helmet as well. Uh, you don't have that stock sort of um, Space Marines helmet on there, so it's a little bit a little bit different. Um, and it is, you know, it's a veteran, so. You know, got those little bit of extra pieces here and there because of their battle experience and all those extra seals and stuff. So, yeah. All right, I'll uh, keep it at that. So I'll post some uh, photos without these sausage fingers uh, being in the way. And uh, you can check it out in a bit more detail. And, um, yeah, thank you very much again for coming to see our Warhammer 40K video. And I um, hope it's been helpful in some sort of way. So this is obviously by Joy Toy. It's one eighth scale. And um, it's a, a Blood Angels veteran called um, Veteran El Abrigo. So I don't know if that's a factual character. As I said, I've sort of been out of the Warhammer 40k game for a number of years, but I did play it a lot when about 30 years ago. <laughs> so it shows my age. 
Um, I suppose I could be called a veteran. <laughs> but I think, uh, yeah, this is a pretty cool looking unit as per usual. And um, I think it's really nice. Uh, so, yeah. All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching and uh, have a great rest of your day. Cheers, guys.